Broadcast news. It requires quality information gathering, accuracy, and meeting deadlines. Your target audience determines what type of news you choose to cover and how you choose to present it. WZZM 13's Brent Ashcroft introduces us to some students who may be on their way to a career in our business. Brent. Juliet, the news doesn't always have to be about doom and gloom. Sometimes box top collections, the big event at recess, or that day's hot lunch menu could be lead stories. These editorial decisions are made at the highest level daily at CNN. That's Caledonia Network News. Do you have this means to go? Any questions you want to ask? This means to get off. We don't want to experiment when we're on live. This. Give them a minute. Is there? Do you know why we give them a minute? Situation room. One, two, three, three, three. It's fast paced. Hey, test. Sound check. Testing. Information rundown. Hold up. Twice read. I'd imagine the book would be there. And one heavy dose of deadline stress. It's amazing. They're like little adults. Because it's time. Give them one minute to do. It just feels like. Um, we're professional. The news. It's an authentic learning situation. Good morning. It's time to tune in to CNN Live. This is CNN. Good morning and welcome to CNN Live. No. Now let's take a look at our weekly forecast. Really? Hi, I'm Brooke. This is. Thank you, Emily, for that delightful forecast. CNN. And I'll be bringing you your national news. Caledonia Network News. Who hasn't heard of CNN? Shelley Abel's fifth grade class has produced CNN for the past 14 years. We do it every day and the school depends on us. Every Monday through Friday morning. And we do a 10 minute segment. At 8.50. Wow. Sharp. I want to tell you how to pack a safe lunch. Tough topics. And for lunch, the cooks will be serving. Tackle. Don't forget to save those box stuffs. Their target audience? Children that range from kindergarten to fourth grade. So, how are the ratings? Our ratings would be really high. 35 fifth graders applied to work at CNN this year. I take their applications and I make teams. Five teams of seven. As I get to know students, I can see who my leaders are. And so, does everybody know what they are? And a born leader. Like you'd say, let's look at our seven day forecast. Quickly emerged. Basically, on Wednesdays, that's, that's just my day to direct my people. Remy Hoover. Okay, so you need to go here, you need to go here, and you need to go there. Remy holds a weekly editorial. Meeting with her team, mm -hmm. yeah. but it comes at a steep price. They give up one recess a week to meet with their team. As any kid, if you have to give up a recess, is anybody doing sports? Or is is, no. is that just out? You'd better make it count. On your sports. Remy takes charge like a seasoned news director. I'm going to work with you too. She stresses teamwork. Take turns in weather and some like contest. Compromise. Can I just promise you this? Next week. And reliability. Oh, yeah. yeah we'll fit that in. It shows your teachers and all your friends and just like how trustworthy you can be, how responsible you can be, and just like what, and it shows what you can do. Remy and the rest of the CNN staff. I am a history geek. Gather the news. Usually an average is around 20 minutes. And write it. It's actually a lot of fun. At home. It's amazing what they come up with. It all started in 1621. By the way. They invited some of the Native Americans. Remy is on the air too. It's a great education, I think. With benefits. I think that whenever you're able to, again, put some authentic learning in place with reading and writing and, and, and technology, I think that that's going to translate very well to, um, to those students later in life. You time in a minute. Like timeliness. We have a lot of great events. Public speaking. And it wasn't any of these. Problem solving. Those are true marketplace skills that you need to have. These news gatherers. Because Tuesday is their day. Don't want to fail. Or Monday is their day and they want that to be Top notch. Just add an ice pack or two. But for all their learning, small lunch ice packs. What they enjoy most, ask your mom to buy some. Celebrity status on the playground, of course. They think you're movie stars because they'll see them out for recess and they'll go, I saw you on the news. Have a great day and not to shame it with the health report. And just like the pros, thank you, Anna Riley. Thank you, and now to Brooke. When the news day is done, thanks for listening. You get ready. The CNN Live. CNN Live. To do it all over again. That's your Caledonia News Network. Tomorrow. That's the wrap, people. It was beautiful, beautiful. Good show, people. Woo! <laughs> Woo Coming up tomorrow on Caledonia Network News. Let a professional do it. Hi, Remy. Absolutely. She's the boss.
Coming up tomorrow on Calorie and Network News, Natalie will have, have weather, Tommy will do school news, Sebastian will have sports, Erica will have some animal stories, and Brooke will do contests. Back to you, Juliet. Thank you so much, Remy. But Brent is not the only one who's been replaced. Look at this. Our normal producer, Jeff, has stepped aside to make room for Natalie. How's it going back there in the control room, Natalie? It's going great. Okay, well, you guys were just fabulous. Here are the members of the Caledonia Network News. What a great group. They have joined us live in studio tonight, and we thank them for being here. What an inspirational group of future broadcasters. Stay with us. There's more news right after the break.